What's up guys, in this video I'm going to show you some tips and tricks with the tank. When it comes to combat with an enemy tank, make sure to remember this important tip. By aiming at the enemy tank, your crosshair changes its color to either red or green. Wolf Thunder players might already know it, but this indicates whether your shots are likely to penetrate or not. When it shows red, your shots are not going to penetrate. Is it indicating green though, you have a realistic chance of penetrating the enemy armor. Keep that in mind, since it is smarter to not shoot a red spot and wait for the tank to move so you can shoot a green spot. By doing that, you win fights way more often because people tend to panic when they see a tank and dump their whole magazine at it, resulting in no damage being delivered. By the way, when your enemy is behind a hay ball, a wooden hut or a tree, keep shooting him since your bullets will shoot through the cover easily. If you ever wondered how to change the ammunition in the tank, here is how to do it. When you press R to change the ammunition, you will have to empty your magazine before you can use the other type. The R symbol shows up at the ammo type that is currently not being used, indicating that when you press R it will change the ammo to it. Once you press R, the icon disappears and you need to empty your mag, then you can use the other type of ammo. You can upgrade your tank by clicking on upgrades in the main menu. Go ahead and select your tank crew and then go to workshop upgrades where you unlock the first upgrade. This allows you to buy spare parts in the shop. To do that you simply click on logistics, weapon delivery and then you buy spare parts for your tank. Each time you buy spare parts it gives you 10 components. You will need 40 components to upgrade the first tank. If that video helped you please drop me a like and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to comment. See you next time.